So ako'y nalungkot ho talaga dahil madalas pa nakikita kami ni Bea ay nakakakwentuhan ho kami tungkol sa buhay, tungkol sa kanila, uh, their marriage plans, etc. So I was shocked na tama si Oji Diaz po. Sabi ng isa kong source, wala na sila. Sa kaibigang Oji nung kanyang balita na hiwalay na As we talk today, yes, hiwalay po si Dominic at saka si Bea D. Alonso at Dominic Roque, kumpirmadong hiwalay na Sa programa na Fast Talk with Boy Abunda ngayong hapon, ibinahagi nito na kumpirmadong hiwalay na nga si B. Alonso at Dominic Roque. Kamakailan na humarap si B. Alonso sa media kung saan? Tinanong ito ukol sa kasal ni na Dominic Roque ngunit marinig mo sa kanyang inihayag na hindi ito makasagot ng diritsahan sa mga katanungan kung saan? Dito na nga pinagdudahan ng mga netizens na may problema ang magkasintahan. Hey, wala, wala pang plano. Parang dapat lalaki ang plano. <laughs> Oo, pero gano'n pa importante na may effort so get some part of guys. I think it, your relationship is always two-way straight. It's not, hindi lang pwede yung lalaki. We are always pushing for equality. So, equality means pati yung effort equal. So, sa relasyon naman namin, wala namang ngayong hapon ay kinumpirma ni Boy Abunda na hiwalay na nga ang dalawa na ayon nga ni Tito Boy na kahit magkaayos ang dalawa ngunit walang maganap na kasalan para sa buong detalye narito ating pakinggan si Boy Abunda uh, Balita na talagang uh, nakalungkot sumindak sa akin habang ako ay nasa Hong Kong ay ang balita po na naghiwalay na si Bea at saka si Dominic Roque I'm talking about Bea Alonso and Dominic Roque Uh, Bea is a good friend. I have uh, known uh, Dom uh, when he was still a very young boy playing badminton. So ako'y nalungkot ho talaga dahil madalas pa nakikita kami ni Bea ay nakakakwentuhan ho kami tungkol sa buhay, tungkol sa kanila, uh, their marriage plans, etc. So I was shocked na tama si Oji Diaz po sa kaibigang Oji nung kanyang balita na hiwalay na. As we talk today, yes, hiwalay po si Dominic at saka si Bea. Um, sinusuyo ba si Bea? Are they still trying to talk? Uh, siguro Ma Maaari uh, Dahil sino ba naman ang ayaw, maayos Ang ganitong klase ng problema As a matter of fact, uh, from good sources Ay Kagabi o nung isang gabi lamang Ay nag-usap muli si Bea at saka si Dominic they're trying to uh, they're trying to understand each other but they're going through a rough patch magkakabalikan ba ito Ma uh, mag uh, tatagumbay ba sa panunuyo si Dominic or sila ni Bea we don't know wala ho uh, makakasagot ng katanungan na yun but of course my prayer is that may God grant them what is best for them um, ito lamang ang uh, nalilito ako Uh, dyan muna tayo sa hiwalay So I am confirming Yes That uh, uh, Hiwalay sila ngayon At uh, Last night Or two nights ago Nag-usap yung dalawa Ano ang status Wala 
Uh, I think kung tama ang aking source, Bea ay isinoli na ang kanilang engagement the ring. But are they hoping? Ako ang hula ko is yes. Kasi hindi naman you don't say tomorrow I'm going to stop loving. Yung prenup po ay medyo na, na shock ako because ang pagkakaalam ko po, uh, many months ago, napag-usapan ho ito sa aking pagkakaalam. And I'd like to confirm this with my friends, my sources. Because when this was being talked about, yung prina po, ang nag-volunteer sa nanay ni Bea na okay ang prina, ay si Dominic. So I don't think it is and it was an issue unless nabago po yung kwento. So inuulit ko, it was not a problem because it was not, a, it was not an issue. To be fair to Dominic, it was not an issue for Dom. So, did they call off the wedding? Yes. Pero marami, ho, ma marami na ho kasi ang lumalabas na uh, April ang wedding, Tagaytay ang wedding, Kinansel ang wedding. There was no April. There was no Tagaytay. There was no wedding that in Tagaytay that was cancelled. Bea and I would often talk about the wedding towards the end of the year, the last quarter of the year. Pero as of now, uh, wala. Walang wedding po na magaganap ngayong darating na Abril. Because in the first place, inuulit ko, there was no wedding in April and it was not going to be in Tagaytay. As originally talked about, uh, nag-ocular po ang dalawa, tama ho yun, uh, sa, sa Europa. And uh, may mga lumalabas sa kwento rin that they went to Japan, tama rin po yun. And I think they were, uh, they were trying to talk things out. Uh, Bea, ito ang ayaw ko, uh, naitay kapuso. Dito sa kwentong ito, Pinapalabas na ang may problema si Bea Alonso kasi naghiwalay sila ni Gerald Anderson, naghiwalay sila ni Zanjo Marudo, ay hindi nagtatagal ang kanyang mga relasyon. To me, napaka-judgmental po nun. Yes, you and I have the right to comment. Yes, we have the freedom of speech. Pero ako ay appeal for kindness. What do we really know about this relationship? Do we know the nuances? Alam ba talaga natin ang detalye? Yung, wag naman, uh, the narrative is not about Bea, ang problema, kaya sila naghiwalay. Sa pagkakaalam ko, ito deretsahan, si Bea gusto ma-save ang relasyon na ito. Si Bea wants this to work. Punta naman tayo doon ki Dominic. Na, masakit din pakinggan. Walang pera, hindi mayaman, hindi sikat, hindi karapat-dapat ki Bea. Cruel. Uh, you have the right to comment, you have the right uh, uh, to share your opinion, pero sanay... Um, Alam niyo po yun, let's exercise prudence, caution, and most important of all, kindness. Huli na lamang, kung halimbawa maayos ang dalawang ito, ito ako uh, from my sources, sigurado ako, pag nagkaayos si Bea sa si Dominic, no wedding is going to happen this year. So ang tabayanan niyo po ang developing story na ito, Bea grew up in front of all of us. I mean, uh, kilala natin yung uh, girl na ito. Uh, I have known Dom for a long time. So, ang tabayanan niyo po ang mga balita. Kung meron po kaming makakalap uh, from our sources or from Bea or from Dominic, ay ibabahagi ho namin sa inyo. But let's continue to pray for what is best for them.